It's time for another Out of Bounds Rewind with Bo Bounds on ESPN 105.9 The Zone. Mike Dettelier on the Out of Bounds Show and the Modelo Guest Line. Mike, uh, so you don't think Texas is number one? Who is number one right now in the recruitment of Arch Manning? I think Clemson is. I've always felt that way. Um, Dabo has had a good relationship uh, with the Manning family. Um, You go back and look at sort of the connect the dots with from Boyd to Watson to Trevor Lawrence, now DJ. You got a pretty good lineage of quarterbacks that have come out of Clemson, recruit and develop. A lot of talent at the receiver position. And it gives Arch an opportunity to uh, – Old Red didn't have Peyton or Eli play for a national championship. That's – yeah. And so, I, I've always felt Clemson – now, listen, a year ago, I, I was reading all this stuff about how LSU was in the top spot, which uh, I, I'm still laughing at. Uh, come on, uh, Arch Manning's not going to LSU. That <laughs> you know, come on, there's a little bit too much there. Um, so that's not, I, I know his teammates are going there, but you know, again, it's a different story. I, I just felt Clemson because they give you so much from a standpoint of lineage at quarterback, a team that can play for a national championship and has. Um, and sort of put them in that position where they, I think, have a slight advantage over the other schools. Mm. Now, do, do the heartstrings pull? Because I, I know how Orange grew up. You know, I know where Cooper was on, on Saturday afternoons. You know, they, they were watching Ole Miss. You know, so th- that, that, that certainly will play a part in it. Uh, uh, Texas is certainly a school to watch because it gives them an opportunity to build something, to be a part of something, to rebuild a program that was once a great program. Uh, but I, I, if you're asking, I, I'm going to say I think Clemson's in the top spot uh, b- because of the advantages that they have and the fact that they have played for national championships and been a national contender. And it keeps him in the South. He's not that far away. Uh, do you think it's a three-horse race? Clemson, Ole Miss, and Texas, and really everybody else is on the outside looking in? Or do you think a, a fourth team or so could get in the mix, Mike? I know I know Georgia and Alabama has, has been in the mix. The, and the same reasons LSU would be hard for me to see him play at Alabama, too. Uh, you know, there's just certain things there. Growing up, uh, it would be difficult. Uh, I know George has recruited him very, very hard, but but I see it. it it's a three horse race here, and and I and I do think that Clemson, Texas, Ole Miss. If you had to handicap it, it would be that. Don't miss one moment of the Out of Bounds Show with Bo Bounds. Weekdays, 7 a.m. till 10 a.m. On ESPN 105.9. The Zone.